6.30 a.m. I slept in a little bit longer than I usually do. I'm very tuckered out right now. And that walk home from the beach with the flat tire really took it out of me. I'm really sunburned in multiple places of my body and exhausted. Um, today, I really need to clean up my apartment. It's a complete war zone in here. There's uh, piles of dishes and I don't have any laundry left. I ran through all my laundry, so I literally don't have any clothes anymore. So, gotta wash some clothes in the bathtub today because I can't go to the laundromat because I'm scared of it because of all the social distancing. Anyways, if I can get this place in good shape today, I'm gonna put a little freshwater tackle box together and you know, the road bike still is a flat. I don't feel like fixing it or going to get a tube. So I think we'll hop on that BMX bike and uh, put a little short, ugly stick rod together and see if we can get ourselves a little largemouth bass at Prospect Park. I haven't been there yet this year. So let's see. a little bit of this aloe vera plant and uh, you know, just rub it all over rub it all over those sunburns got so much sand in my bathtub from showering after going to the beach it's just constantly accumulating now as you can see I have no clothes right now that I can wear except for this fancy shirt a little bit that dirty, I got the hiccups right now. Looks like we should be able to get out there for a couple hours and try out some fishing at Prospect Park. I got the Pen Clash 4000 with a 8 pound braided and I got a couple little jig heads put together here. Um, a couple of these guys, uh, kind of rattles, let's call it like a Rapala or something, I don't even know. Uh, a couple Castmasters. Which is probably going to be the one they're hitting. Uh, one thing to be aware of the Prospect Park is that the they're pretty small fish and uh, they tend to swallow the hook. So bring like some needle nose pliers or something with you, just in case it happens. It's it's rare, but it definitely happens. Uh, this little swim bait. Who knows if this will work? Um, and these little jig heads. This is probably going to nail them. Tend to be pretty effective. And, you know, some longer little worms. Let's 
Big old frog in front of us. Hello, duck friends. There's a lot of human beings here and they keep coming up to me and talking to me about fishing, which normally I wouldn't care about it all. I love talking about fishing, but this whole pandemic thing has got me really worried. And I keep asking people to leave me alone, which is very awkward. So I'm gonna go do some wheelies on my bicycle. Well, I'm back in the lab, and unfortunately the human population drove us away from both fishing and riding the BMX bike at the parks. My bubble felt very invaded today, and this is the first time in over a month that I've been around the mass population in Brooklyn. And I must say, there isn't very much social distancing actually happening. I think I'm going to spend the next few weeks hanging out in Jamaica Bay, fishing and learning some new terrain, and avoiding the mass population of the human species. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Bye.